Prince Harry went all out for the first gift he bought for Prince Louis, and he once dreamed of setting his nephew up with a library to read expensive books from. He's just released his own tome, but it seems Prince Harry was already a book lover before becoming an author. The Wayward Royal reportedly gifted nephew Prince Louis with a first edition copy of A.A. Mills Winnie the Pooh at his christening in 2018. There are only 30,000 first edition copies of the 1926 children's classic in existence, according to the Mirror, with Prince Harry forking out a cool $9,860 for the present. The thoughtful gift was said to have been inspired by Princess Diana who collected first edition copies of her favorite books. One of Harry's happiest childhood memories was being read a bedtime story by his mother, a source told the publication. She loved all the old classics and Prince Harry had the brilliant idea of starting a little library of first editions for Louis and his siblings, Charlotte and George to enjoy as they get older. He originally wanted to get Lewis Carroll's Through the Looking Glass which was on sale for $29,000, but decided Winnie the Pooh would be more suitable for a first tome, the insider added. Robinson Crusoe was William's favorite book, but Harry loved all things A.A. Mill. Prince Harry's brother, Prince William, and sister-in-law, Princess Kate, were reportedly thrilled by the thoughtful gift for their youngest son. The family-friendly Mill book is a far cry from Harry's naughty new memoir spare which is chock full of raunchy revelations, including details of how he lost his virginity in a field to an older woman who treated him like a young stallion. The tawdry tome also includes a now infamous anecdote, which has been widely mocked online, in which Harry reveals how he treated his frost-bitten penis with Elizabeth Arden cream. Prince Louis christening took place in July 2018, just two months after Harry married Meghan Marco at Windsor. It would be another 18 months before the couple spectacularly split from the royal family in a move dubbed Magixt. Before then, it seems, Harry and Meghan both had a reputation as stellar gift givers. In 2016, Meghan gifted William with a witty novelty gift for Christmas. The suit star had the words serial killer engraved on a spoon for the future king, who was reportedly humored by the punny present. Prince Harry and his brother have spent the five years since that event trading very public blows against each other, with the former sharing many details of the apparent war between them in his tell-all book spare. Last month, during an interview with ITV News at 10 presenter Tom Brabby that he claimed that he just want my father and brother back. He said, it never needed to be this way, the leaking and the planting. I want a family, not an institution. They feel that it's somehow better to keep us as the villains. They've shown no willingness to reconcile. I would like to get my father back. I would like to have my brother back. It's unclear whether Harry and Meghan will return for King Charles' upcoming coronation, but the new monarch has reportedly asked the Archbishop of Canterbury to help broker peace talks between his warring sons. Thank you for watching our latest video about the royal family. We always try to regularly update the latest news videos about the British royal family to meet your requirements. Our channel always has an objective, multi-dimensional view of the news. My main goal is just to entertain people. Hope you enjoy this news. If you have any questions or requests about content to watch, please leave a comment below this video of us.